Reuters reports that NASA plans to launch its massive new SLS rocket for an unmanned test mission around the moon later this year. The first version of the SLS will tower 23 stories above the launch pad. Its core stage houses two large storage tanks, one for liquid hydrogen and another for the liquid oxygen that makes the hydrogen burn. These liquids are fed into the engine chambers and ignited with a spark, where the chemical reaction produces vast amounts of energy and steam. The core stage has four RS-25 engines, the same ones that powered the space shuttle. The steam exits the engine nozzles at high speed, generating enough thrust to push the giant into space. Two solid rocket boosters give the rocket extra power to escape gravity's clutches. These twin boosters stand more than 17 stories tall and burn 6 tons of solid propellant each second. They provide 75% of total thrust during the first two minutes of flight. Once in orbit, the crew capsule will detach from the SLS and use its space engine to get all the way to the moon.